All right. Uh, my name is Tom Woodward. I'm from Richmond, Virginia, and this is my amazing story. I put all my pictures up on Flickr under a Creative Commons license, and uh, one day I got an email through Flickr from uh, someone in Russia, of all places, who was looking to use a picture of a book I took in the uh, University of Richmond Library in uh, you know a, a nationally published magazine over there called Hermitage. And I gave my permission, and, you know, just kind of excited to see it be published or used by anyone, honestly. And uh, they were kind enough to send me two copies of the magazine, one in Cyrillic and one in English. So, you know, just a really cool example of international use and uh, a real, real exciting thing for me as a uh, photographer. You know, I put up all my work on Flickr under Creative Commons, and uh, the other day I was contacted by someone from a French museum who found an image that was actually put up on Wikipedia by someone else of, a, of oddly enough, a parrot I took at a local uh, blueberry patch. And it's now going to be in an inter, you know, at one of the national uh, French museums to help illustrate uh, the plight of the rainforest. So really bizarre that a picture I take in Richmond, Virginia of a rescued parrot ends up in France in a museum, you know. So it's just kind of beautiful how these international connections work. I, th I think you can kind of encourage serendipity through tagging, and it seems like a lot of people find things through Wikipedia. So if you put your images in both places, you know, or... You know, it's really through tagging that I think most of my things have been found. And then they've been used by lots of different people, but, you know, you can kind of look in your search history and see how people are finding your stuff. So the better you title and tag, the more chances there are that people will find your stuff and actually use it.